And we are back! In this video I'll be sharing my F1 23 Hungary setup. And this setup for Hungary is designed for racing, not for time trials. I have specifically optimized it for racing in my team, career mode and online. And while you can also use this setup for time trial and achieve a fast lap time, its main focus is for racing distance. The F1 23 Hungary setup is well balanced to ensure optimal performance throughout the entire race. The car's balance and tire wear are carefully considered to help you remain competitive throughout the race. And additionally, I would like to mention that I share one or more setups every day. To ensure you don't miss any of them, please subscribe to my channel and stay updated with my latest F1 23 setups. Now let's take a look at my fastest lap at Hungary in F1 23. And it is important to mention that I drove this lap with my race setup. While my goal wasn't to set the fastest lap time for the leaderboard, I've heard in the past that you all enjoy watching a hot lap to see the braking points, steering inputs and how I accelerate. And that's why I include a hot lap in every video. However, this F1 23 Hungary setup is optimized for a race distance. And that's where its strength lies. One important difference between a time trial setup and a race setup is the tire pressure. The tire pressure is much higher in time trial, which also makes you generally faster. There are also many other differences that makes the time trial setup faster over one lap than the race setup. But this car is perfectly balanced for a race, even with worn tires, you always have control over the car. And this is ideal for races in my team, career mode and online. You'll truly notice the benefits of the setup in races that are 25% or longer, as that's when the tire wear becomes a factor. If you use time trial setup or don't have a good race setup, you'll encounter many difficulties on this challenging track. Hungary demands a significant amount of grip. With numerous corners and regular acceleration moments, you need your tires to maintain the performance throughout the entire race. And with this F1 23 setup for Hungary, you'll be able to achieve fast times throughout the race. Now let's dive into my F1 23 Hungary setup. For aerodynamics, I chose a front wing of 50 and a rear wing of 45. I made this decision to achieve more rotation from the wings while still maintaining a good amount of top speed. If you feel like you want a slightly more balanced car, you can increase the rear wing from 45 to 46. The differential is set at 56 and 51. With 56 I had excellent traction when coming out of the corners, even with worn out tires. For off throttle I selected 51%. This choice helps to keep the car balanced when you're not applying the throttle. It's especially beneficial during the fast corners in Hungary. The camber and toe are set at minus 2.8, minus 1, 0 0.05 and 0 0.15. This worked perfectly for me and managed my tire wear on Hungary. Suspension are set at 28, 7, 5, 1 and 33, 37. Suspension plays a crucial role on any circuit and for Hungary this setup ensures good rotation without the car over rotating. It allows you to maintain control of the car so you can confidently attack the corners of Hungary. The brake settings are 156%. If you notice that the rear tires lock up during braking, you, you can increase the rear balance to 57%. Lastly, the tire pressures are set at 22.1 for the front tires and 20.0 for the rear tires. Hungary is a circuit with many corners and the tires face a tough challenge here. And that's why I try to keep the tire temperature as low as possible, because when the temperature is above 104 degrees, it can impact your speed. And if necessary, you can also lower the pressure of the front tires by one click. And that concludes my F1 23 Hungary setup. Please give me feedback on the setup in the comments, and I'll be sharing new F1 23 setups, as well as tips and tricks to improve your speed in this game on a daily basis. To ensure you don't miss out on these setups and tips, make sure to subscribe to my channel and enable notifications. Thank you for watching and enjoy using this F1 23 Hungry setup.